and welcome to this week's video. Are you ready for all the holiday parties and New Year's Eve festivities that are literally right around the corner? I know you may be thinking, whoa, Nelly, I'm still working on Christmas gifts. I don't have a minute to start preparing and planning for all of this. Let me just say, I wanna put this on your radar because these parties are gonna come around the corner real quick and planning and preparation is everything. If you follow me on social media, you know that I was at the Galleria Mall the other week shopping for you. Seriously, shopping for you. I wanted to round up a wide variety of clothes and price points. So I hit two stores. I went to Macy's and Saks and then also Revolve Online. I'm kind of covering the gamut from your traditional Christmas party all the way up to the glitz and the glam of the New Year's Eve, the disco night, the dance until the wee hours, all of that. So when I went shopping, there are a couple of things that matter to me and I figure they're gonna to matter to you as well. First of all, I wanna be comfortable, okay? Not only do I wanna look good, I wanna feel good. Because let's face it, we're probably gonna be eating and drinking, so we need things that have a little stretch and a little bit of give so that we can enjoy the rest of the night without you know, having our blood circulation cut off and turning red in the face. I think also a lot of different styles for a lot of different ages. So I really need to think about all of that as I'm shopping as well and preparing. It's kind of a wide range. Let's see how well I did. I'm gonna start off really with the most conservative and probably the most casual of the holiday outfit. So this is your standard, you know, I've been invited to a Christmas gathering. It could be afternoon, could be early evening. So we're not bringing the glitter, the glam, the sparkle and all of that until later. Now, you know me, I like to name my outfits because I'm kind of silly that way. So this outfit is called wrapping paper. I would really consider this a timeless classic for a more conservative affair. It's Lauren Ralph Lauren plaid skirt with gold buckle detail. And I adore this little navy rib fitted top with the gold buttons that add just a little bit of pop and those cute little flared sleeves. Now, of course, it doesn't scream holiday this, but when you pair it with red pumps, a red trench coat, a reddish colored lippy, and a red purse, well, that pulls it all together. And that's why this looks like wrapping paper to me. I think I've wrapped plenty of stuff in plaid with this combo going on. You know, it's really classic elegance for an understated holiday party. These colors are festive, but they can honestly be worn year round and put with other separates. I personally love a red coat. I think a red coat needs to be in every woman's wardrobe. I purchased uh, this whole outfit in store. I could not find it online, sadly. The top was 53, the skirt was 111, both of them were 40% off. I'm going to provide some options along with several Lauren Ralph Lauren plaid alternatives in the links below, which is where you're going to find every outfit seen in this video. I really like it. It's kind of preppy. It's, it's I don't know, it's, it's pretty. To me, it's just a pretty simple classic look. So now we're going to dial it up a little bit. We're getting more into the metallics and this dress I'm going to call candelabra. The dress is tiered and not tired. So you'll be bright eyed when the ball drops. This DKNY gold pleated ruffled sleeveless cocktail dress gives ease of movement and unrestricted flow. You can dance the night away in this kind of metallic greenish gold mini dress with the halter styling. I find this mini not to be overly short. I felt comfortable in it. But if you want more leg coverage, you could also wear maybe some decorative sheer black pantyhose and a high boot to go along with it. If not, don't forget yourself tanner. You'll need it. Twirl on the dance floor to let the ruffles flow and enjoy the holiday treats without worrying about Spanx or your wallet. This beauty was marked down in my Macy's to 111 bucks. Online, it's 139, and sizes run from two to 14. I think metals work great against a lot of skin tones. And what I did, you know, this was a very inexpensive dress, but I took more expensive earrings that I purchased in Rome, uh, a bracelet that my mother gave me, my Valentino rock stud pumps, and it really dressed it up and elevated it to the point where nobody would really know that this was a $111 DKNY dress. And that's the secret. It's knowing what to pair it with to really bring it out and make it look elegant, to make it look more expensive and accessorizing is really key. So I'm just showing you different accessories to give you ideas as to what you can do with outfits that you find to kind of bump it up a notch, right? 
All right, so now we are moving into the bedazzled and the sparkle and sequin. This one I'm calling ornament. This ruby red color with a magenta kick in the dress reminds me of those famous heels worn by Judy Garland in The Wizard of Oz. There's no place like home, but you will be old school Hollywood glam if you're hosting this year. This Revolve Sarai midi dress by House of Harlow 1960 is a stretch sequin dress. It is fitted, but it does have some give to it. That side zipper cinches you in and the strapless top will stay put because it's got a built-in adhesive across the top. The midi length, I think, makes it a classic for those who aren't comfortable going short, but the occasion doesn't call for long either. Sizes in this dress run from extra, extra small to extra large. This beautiful dress is $248. And I went back to Revolve to find another sparkly one. Not so bold in the sparkle, but what I really love about this dress is the color. It's interesting because it's not your traditional gold, silver, or red and green. It's kind of a shimmery brown. So I'm going to call it gingerbread. Well, iced gingerbread. I really like the fact that this dress is not a traditional holiday color, which means I'm going to get a lot of use for it at cocktail parties throughout the year. It really is rare for me to see a sparkling brown, plus that puff shoulder detail, squared off neckline that does allow for a strapless bra, and then that fabulous low angle of the hem, kind of high-low, makes this a design standout in my opinion. The Venosa dress by Aster the Label is a comfortable mix of nylon, metallic, and elastane. It is partially lined with a black liner that really kind of cinches things in and holds you in place after you pull it on. No zippers, nothing. You just slip it on. It runs from a size extra small to large. It is true to size and the benefit is the stretch if you're slightly off, right? So I wouldn't worry so much about that. I think this dress is probably one of my favorites for a couple of reasons. Just the style and the design I think is just so ridiculously cool. But the price point on this one, $128. Thank you, Santa. Okay, so now I trekked through the mall, made my way over to Saks Fifth Avenue, jumped it up a notch in terms of designer and price point, but still not crazy. You know, things can go well up to a thousand and I will not feature that on this channel. I think that's nuts. So I tried to do the best that I can with what I have at the higher price point. And I think I did pretty well. So there's a designer at Saks that I love and it's Maj, M-A-J-E. And I don't know if you've heard of them or tried any of their clothing, but the styling is simply beautiful, elegant. Again, has some stretch and some give, which I like, but fitted. So the first one is what I call apple martini. La May, you say? Oh yeah, this silvery green pleated dress is by Maj. The long V-neck can be worn very open, revealing a deeper neckline, or it can be pinned closed. Beautiful billowy sleeves are met with that ruched fitted waist and hip, and then a flare and a pleating in the skirt. Surprisingly, this is one of the longer minis I found. Many dresses are short, short, short. So this is as short as I'm going. It's 100% polyester with that elastane for stretch. Side zipper closure. Now the top is sheer, I mean really sheer, but I've got a skin colored bra on to hide the sheerness so you cannot see through whatsoever. The younger generation is actually wearing this dress with designer sparkly tennis shoes and a bomber jacket. They like to kind of bring it down, make it a little bit more street. I bumped it up, played on that silvery metallic, so I added a sparkly silver shoe and more of a gunmetal sparkle purse, same with the earrings. Now, I will say they don't have this green color available online, but they do have a beautiful shimmery pale pink. The dress runs $400. $45. So if you pick the pink, your drink is going to be Pink Lady and not Apple Martini, just so we're clear. Sizes run from two to 10. All right, last but not least, one of my favorites as well. Oh my gosh, I had to throw in a pant. I had to throw in gold. So I'm calling this sucker 
tinsel. So I mentioned Judy Garland earlier, right? Well, now we're paying homage to the queen of turtlenecks and flared trousers. Liza Minnelli put the pizzazz in pants. This Maj gold sequin stretch top and flare pant screams cabaret, my friend. Ring in the new year with this close fitting stretch gold sequin top and pants reminiscent of the Studio 54 days. Hey, you're gonna win the Emmy for best gold outfit and you're gonna be the most comfortable on the dance floor. The long sleeve top runs from size small to large is $235 and the flared pants run from extra small to large and they're $265. Now, while this is on the higher price point side, I feel this outfit stands the test of time and transcends what's trending. I've provided links to it and other options for you in black and silver in the description below, just in case you don't want to be a disco ball. Maybe you want to have a little sparkle, but go with the black, or maybe silver matches your skin color a little bit better. But that rounds out my holiday lookbook for you. Um, boy, that was fun to do. Now I just need a party. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, I've got something to wear. I hope you found this video helpful. If you like the makeup look, it is the exact makeup look from last week's video, which is the holiday makeup tutorial. So I'll provide a link to that video as well if you want to do uh, this type of a look. With all of the outfits that you saw, it was the exact same look. I just swapped out a hot pink or a red type of a lip, but the rest is all the same, hair is the same, and yada, yada, yada. Next week's video will be a Q&A video, so I'll be soliciting questions in my um, social media channels on Instagram and Facebook, so please make sure you follow me there so I can see your question and hopefully be able to answer it in the following week's video as we wind down 2022 and mentally get our heads around 2023 and all that we are thinking of and planning for. Enjoy your parties, glitz and glam it up, have fun, but be careful, be safe, not too much, okay? And I'll see you next Thursday, bye.